Smart Choice was developed by the American English editorial team of Oxford University Press right here in New York City. Smart Choice is inspired by the classroom, by the realities of everyday language teaching and learning. The original concept and the changes we have made to the new edition are based on the experience, on the feedback, and on the ideas of teachers from all around the world. As teachers, we understand the importance of active learning in class, the importance of independent learning, and the importance of students being able to connect what they are studying in class with the real world beyond. In a series of three one-hour webinars this fall, I'll be presenting strategies for how we can use smart devices to enhance what students are learning in class, to provide meaningful opportunities for independent learning, and to connect the English that they are learning with the world around them. On September the 7th, we'll examine the potential for using smart devices in language learning. We'll take a look at the psychology of the selfie generation, explore some smart device-based activities that you can use to reinforce students' learning in the classroom, and ways in which students' own smart devices can make every classroom a technology-enhanced classroom. We'll examine the potential of the basic features of smartphones, such as the ability to take photos, make videos, and send messages. In addition, we'll be looking at the new smartphone optimized content for Smart Choice 3rd Edition. Designed primarily for independent learning, we'll look at ways in which this content, called On the Move, can encourage students to become more active and independent learners. So please join me in the fall for this series of three webinars on how to use smart devices in language learning. Please note that each webinar will be presented live twice on the dates listed here. You can sign up for the webinars at this web address. And although I would really like you to participate live, please note that these webinars will be recorded and you'll be able to find them by searching for Oxford University Press Webinar Library. Thank you very much and I hope to see you in the fall.